Welcome to my next video and we're making the frame for the bottom box. So the top box I call my breeding box. That's where the beetles are going to breed and lay their eggs. And this is the birth box. This is where the the baby the eggs are going to be dropping where the baby larvae are going to be born and where they will turn into pupae. So this is the bottom box. Now I've done most of the frame already. I just wanted to show you the last piece so you have an idea how to make the frame for the bottom box. Now some people and you can buy boxes that's that stack inside each other in which case you may not need a frame but that I find them hard to get and when I have seen them they've been three or four times the price of a normal plastic box and oh, I want my I want the, my mealworm farms to last for a very very long time and you know putting the frame in is is going to do the job so let's carry on and just finish this frame off So I've already cut the wood to size, again just have a look at the tools you're going to need, a drill, a square, a spirit level, pencil, marker pen, there's a Phillips screwdriver there, a saw and a tape measure and the, just the three screws I'm going to need to put the last piece of the frame on. So I'm going to take the frame and the marker pen and this bit of bevel. I've already cut the wood to size just to save time on the there we go. I'm going to put the spirit level on. I don't know whether you can see that. But that is perfectly straight. That bubble right in the middle, so you you know your frame is straight. What I'm going to do now is mark. I don't want my three holes to go. Keep the spirit level there, make sure it stays straight. The dog you see running about is my dog. She's a Staffordshire Bull Terrier called Tilly. Hello, how's it going? And just keep that on to make sure it stays straight, the spirit level.
I don't know whether anyone's got a Staffordshire Bull Terrier watching this video. But they live life a hundred miles an hour. Absolute crazy dogs. That's the that's the frame. Okay, so that's the bottom box. That's the larvae box, the birthing box. This is where the eggs will actually drop, and where the the larvae will start to grow. You're going to need two or three of these boxes because you're going to need to change them. But there you go. That's it.